Okay, before I jump into more things uh, related to storytelling, let's talk about how our Power BI content is organized. You will notice that on this page, there's certain elements where the cursor changes into a hand. Normally, this would mean that uh, this is something clickable. And you can try to click it, and uh, if you just left click on, on those things, you will see that nothing happens. However, if you hit uh, press down the control key on your keyboard and then click you will see that things change okay so um, the way this is organized is um, we have a main section uh, I might add a few things here in title page and then on the bottom right you will see um, class videos so if you control left click on class videos you will have a list of all of the videos related to this class Again, right now I have a test list. Most likely this list will change dramatically by the time you're taking this class. In order to close this window, you hit Control X and this window will go away. So what you will do is for every uh, lab, uh, there's gonna be a uh, start page. So uh, you will click on, a, for example, we have a lab called First Report. And in this report, you start with something that's already kind of there, and you could uh, start from there instead of starting from the completely uh, blank page. And you will have a video in, in which I will be talking about some of the steps. Uh, my video, my explanation could be detailed, where I'm dragging things and changing colors. But uh, my guess is if I do too much of it, it'll take forever. Uh, and we do want to challenge you a little bit, so I may or may not show everything in the video. Uh, I might have you um, kind of struggle a little bit and try to figure out where to find certain elements necessary to build the report. Most likely, early on, you will have a lot of help from me. And then, at the end, you could click on the checkbox. Again, don't forget to click on the control or hold control key to see what the final uh, element or the final result of that lab should look like. Okay, and then to go back to main, you could just control, click on main, you'll go right back. By the time this training is fully built out, uh, there will probably be many, many tabs at the bottom. So my guess is you will be uh, easily confused if you had to navigate using pages. So the easiest way to navigate, again, is just to use the navigation I will create for you here in the left. 